My name is Kiri Sabodin, and today I will be teaching you basic phone repair principles. So phones are a really big part of our society these days, and I think it's a good skill to know how to fix them. Let's get started. The first step when solving a problem or fixing a phone that you don't really understand is to research it. Google or YouTube has some great DIY videos for phone repair. But for this video's purposes, I'm going to walk you through how to take apart a phone and then be able to identify and recognize different parts or connections that might potentially need repair. Before taking the phone apart, try fully charging it and doing a reset, as this is can sometimes fix the problem. Once this is done, let's get to taking this phone apart. The supplies you'll need are a phone, a 1.5 millimeter Phillips screwdriver, a magnet tape or tray to hold the screws, and a pick. Either one of these would work to help separate the layers. I'm using an LG phone for today's video as it is easier and needs less specialty screwdrivers and tools to take apart. Also, my Apple phone that I repaired is currently videoing. So on the back, you'll be able to see a little notch and you can use this and pry it apart. Let's take off the backing. And then you should be able to see 12 screws that need to be undone. You just go and you unscrew. Once the screws are removed, we can flip over to the front screen facing up, and then take our fingers and work on prying off the top. This is when the pick comes in helpful. It's turning on. Soon we'll be removing the battery. We can pull off these sides. We remove the battery. then you can look what the phone inside looks like. So, when looking for repairs, we can look and see that this, with where it was laying, was the camera and its corresponding cord attachment. So right here, um, this right here, you can see the front. This is the front side camera. And it's again corresponding cord. You can then also see where the battery attaches, for power, um, where the speakers. The speaker actually is more along here than this part. And you can see here is where the screen attaches and if you wanted to do a screen repair you'd flip this off and separate this blue and metallic layer from the screen of the LG phone and then reattach it. Also when looking for screen repair or other common phone issues you can look for bumped or slightly jarred connections, maybe torn or twisted cords, um, or other things you can tap gently um, on these to reaffirm their connection. Um, and if, once you put it back together and that doesn't work, uh, then you know that part may need to be replaced. So, now we're putting it back together. So when reattaching the back, you can grab the screen and then the backing we just took off and then 
you should always place the bottom, the one with the logo, and the first. As again, it's the most difficult part to get on and off. And just press it in, gently squeezing, reattaching, snapping it back in. This side and it's reattached. Flip it back over and we work again, putting in those screws. Once all the screws are in place, we can just retake the backing and put back on. Snap, snap. And now turn it on and you can see it's turning on and it's good to go. You can test it, say if the speaker or camera were wrong or if they're broken and you can then make sure that they're working and know you're good. I hope you'll be able to take maybe some of these principles and know that you can do it girl. You can take apart a phone, fix it and solve any problem before you. See ya!